We got a big lot. The first five are Marvel DVDs. Just to help grow my Marvel collection. Finally have this movie. This isn't the director's cut, but I do hope to find that someday. Or if there even is a director's cut of Electrica. Or Electra. Sorry if you can hear all that noise in the background. I'm trying to go as fast as I can because there's a lot in here. I'm only missing the first Blade film. Missing Spider-Man 3. I don't have time to show promo material in this video. This one I got sealed from Dollar General. However, these things are broken. Like, I'll probably go show this in some other video, but... Yeah. Hang on. Alright. This one's sealed, but I'm not going to open it in this video. Cover is the dimension. This is one of two of the, of the SpongeBob DVDs I got today, and this is the first ever. This was the first ever SpongeBob DVD ever made, 18 years ago. Really awesome. Focus. My first ever Fox Searchlight film. Cover use with Paramount and MTV. Yeah. This is the director's cut. Again, I'm sorry if you can hear all that noise in the background. One of the best Star Wars films ever made. This is my second copy. It's also one I'm gonna get around to watching sometime. I heard it's great. And he's got um, Tenant coming up next, Christopher Nolan. Out of all the live action remakes that Disney's done, this is the only one that I would call good. Like, like, I think this is the only, if, if you're wanting to watch live action Disney films, just like, like live action Disney remakes, just watch this one. Like, Lion King 2019 has no soul put into it. I, I haven't seen the movie, but I can just immediately tell. Camp Coral is coming next month, and in two months we're getting Sponge on the Run, which is good. I have a full screen version of this, but... Oops. Forgot to have these things I don't like. But this is the widescreen versions, which means I can now watch this movie 